In Santa Rosa County, Hurricane Sally caused quite a bit of damage, not just along the coast, but also inland along rivers. WKRG.com mobile journalist Daniel Smithson gives us a look at the damage along the Blackwater River. Just a few days ago, the river walk near downtown Milton was completely underwater. The water has since receded, but it has left behind a mess for residents to clean up. Ray and Joanne Duckworth have been through tropical weather along the Blackwater River in Milton many times before, but this time it was different. First time in our life we got rescued out of here. We've been living here for 34 years and uh, we had the, I guess it was a search and rescue coming in. They did a great job. The couple did not want to leave their property. We, we wasn't going to evacuate. We told them, no, we're going to ride it out. But we decided for the better we needed to get out. Yeah, you get a few belongings together and uh, you get into the, the boat or the Zodiac and head out. Luckily for the Duckworths, the majority of the mess left from Sally along River Road came from sand washing onto land. They were out cleaning it up Monday morning. The Duckworth's neighbor, Walter Vaughn, said he took precautions to secure his property, but was surprised at the storm's power. The day I've slipped up on for this one really slipped up. We didn't expect this much volume. Vaughn was pleasantly surprised despite the flooding. His yard birds made it out okay. I was showing the river coming up, and I said, I hope them birds down there can swim. So uh, anyway, they swam. They they weathered the storm just fine. The damage left from Sally is still a shock for many. Everyone in the whole general area, Pensacola, everywhere, did not expect this. Now today I've seen residents in the area coming together to help get things back to normal. Reporting in Milton, I'm Daniel Spitzen, WKRG News 5.